Most people probably don't think that they will be using a lot of math, but the math that we use here in video production and advanced film and cinema really has to do with real world problems and solutions like budgeting. We investigate how much are their costs, and then the students learn about how much their time is worth in the real world. So if they were doing an actual video production project, a film, if they were doing a commercial, if they were doing some type of promotional video, they figure out how much their proposed budget is, and at the end, after keeping track of what their time was really worth and all of the equipment that they use, then they come up with their final budget. So that is one way we use math. Another way that we use math would be through the timing of the shows. We have to know exactly how long sound bites are and figure that into uh, the overall total running time, or TRT, of our pieces. Can I say two things? Two things. One is going out to places and actually recording, because that's pretty cool. And then the second thing is putting all that stuff on my resume. To be successful in this class, it's just like being successful in life. Show up, follow the rules, and do your best. That's really the biggest part of it. And by follow the rules, we treat this as a very professional work environment, and we take very good care of our gear as well. So that's really the best way to be successful. Show up, do your work, follow the rules. You always have to be doing something, either, either editing, shooting a video, uh, in the audio booth, doing a podcast, uh, or in the studio, uh, just trying to make a, a news type um, video. In this class, we make short films, commercials, um, ESAs, and, and, oh, and podcasts. The best advice I have for incoming students is don't be afraid to get outside of your comfort zone a little bit. I know it can be tough, but the friends that you will make in this class will be lifelong friends. Uh, don't be afraid to try something new. Don't be afraid to push buttons. Um, learn about all the different careers that are out there and uh, just, um, just be confident. Your work is good. And if I can help students realize that, then that's uh, something really important that we try to get across. It's so amazing because like we get to do things that not even some news studios get to do because of all this equipment we have. Working with all the high tech stuff we have, it's pretty neat to you know, get your hands on it and understand how it all works and see how it works. It's really fun and interesting.